Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. LCD versus DLP, go. So this is actually a, a thing that's more prevalent in projectors than it is in regular televisions because while you can compare an LCD television to a DLP television, you know, usually that's a contrast of is it this thick or is it this thick? Right. But with projectors, you have two possible technologies. DLP that uses a whole series of little mirrors that change and you bounce light off them and each one of those becomes a pixel on the projected screen. Or LCD where you pass light through a liquid crystal display and project that onto the wall. The advantage of an LCD projector is you don't get any of the rainbowing that comes from DLP. You know, how, what, how does the rainbow effect even happen? The rainbow effect happens because there are three colors of light that the DLP has to project, it has to line those up, and it's using a spinning mirror to do it. So it's really spinning, the light bounces, hits the screen. So you're going, you know, red, green, blue, red, green, blue, red, green, blue, but you're also lighting up those pixels, and really only one pixel is ever actually lit up. It just appears that they're all lit up because of the way the light bounces and such. When you track your head or move your eye, you can be going the same direction as those pixels are lining uh -huh. up. And so then you can see the colors and you get the rainbows. Um, you never get a rainbow with the LCDs. There's two types of LCD projection. One uses a single LCD that contains all three colors. Those are nice because then you get very true representation and you never have convergence issues because there's another one that uses three LCDs with basically three light sources, right. and one for red, one for green, one for blue. The problem with that is if those ever get out of alignment, you get convergence issues where everybody exactly. has yeah. this funny blue line around them or a yeah. funny red line around them. Or anytime you've got a single line going across the screen, instead you get the nice little red, green, blue rainbow right. going across the screen. Hmm. And so, you know, that's the, that's the difference. And sometimes LCD projectors are called LCOS projectors. You also see LCOS. Oh, I've never... I haven't done much. I've never had uh, DLP technology. I've never owned anything that had DLP in it um, that I know of. So DLP has gotten a lot better over the years. Uh, if you go to a movie theater and watch a digital projection movie, which mm. most movie theaters are now, they're all DLP. Oh, I didn't know that. They're, they're much bigger DLPs. Um, yeah, how come you don't get rainbow effects at movies then? You can. Um, the diff different are people are different levels of sensitive to, to those things. Mm. And then most of the movie theater projectors have two DLPs because they're set up for doing the 3D stuff. And so one DLP spins right to left and the other spins left to right. And that helps cancel out the rainbows. <laughs> I think we should cancel out more rainbows. You're, you're one of those rainbow haters, aren't you? I like rainbows. And, and unicorns probably too. That poop glitter. 